two, one. Too slower. We'll just wait for, we're going to wait for the audience to, to come on live. I'll just help it go viral a little bit. Nice meeting you. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Just do an intro. I'm just waiting for some more people to come in to this live. We're going to be looking at Russia, Ukraine, and and just trying to create uh, more understanding about the about the bigger picture. And I have with me um, this this lady. Uh, she's from Russia. She's half Ukrainian. She's half Russian. And you're, I assume you're a Canadian citizen yeah, as well, Canadian, yeah. a Canadian citizen as well. But we're going to hear it directly from her. She's only one opinion. It looks pretty clear. Yeah, and Jill, but let's let's hear it from someone who has relatives in, in the Ukraine, relatives in Russia, who's invested there. And uh, we'll start this now. Okay. Just hold it steady. So Anastasia, how, how long have you been in Canada? So I've been in Canada since 2001 and uh, we were waiting for the better life in Russia after the USSR, waiting, waiting and in 2001 we moved to Canada for better life. Yes. And at the beginning, yes, everything was better and there is opportunities to grow, to make business if you are hard working people, there is opportunity a better life there is a safer life in Canada that's what we thought but apparently now you don't know where is safer is it maybe in in a year it will be much safer to live in Russia because what's yeah. happening here in Canada yeah. with all the uh, government which is corrupted and uh, they are not nice people they are anti-christ they are satanist they protect pedophiles and they're against our children. So yeah, for, Fair well, for my for my son, yeah. it's scary right now. As I am against all the vaccines, I want to live a healthy life. I want yeah. to eat healthy food, and there is no opportunities for me to live this healthy life anymore. Yeah. Because our society is sick. They need a doctor, a real doctor, not a killer doctor. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, let's let's turn to. You're from the, the southeast corner of Russia. Yeah. What's so, the name of the place? So the place I'm from is Vladivostok, which is the other side of Pacific Ocean by China, Korea, Japan. So it's only 30 minutes on the bus to China. Wow. So I've been there many Interesting. times. Interesting. And you have um, your father's Ukrainian, your mother's Russian. Yes. You have relatives in Ukraine. Yes. And. Are, are you aware that this thing in Russia, Ukraine has been going on since at least 2014 with Donbass? So that's already when it started very huge, yeah, right? Huge. Yeah. And it was before that even. And it's after the USSR when Ukraine uh, decided to separate, everybody thought, well, it's just going to be a different country, but we're still the same, we're working together. This is just a little bit economic change but pretty much we are the same people yeah. and everybody thought no changes will happen uh, people Russian speaking in Ukraine they were living life as Russian people but after they start to get attacked those Russian people yeah. you are not allowed to speak Russian in school they are being uh, uh, teaching you know teach Russian still Russian Sickening. so everything the history was changed completely Russia Russia phobia and the Western media is doing this garbage. It's a complete hypocrisy, double, double speak, right? Yeah. So we view Russia, Ukraine, the, the war is a proxy war of US, EU, NATO. Yeah, it's how easy to brainwash and confuse people so quick. Yeah. Yeah. Before we were celebrating as a family together, wow. winning the Nazis. Wow. And on TV, they show Russia is bad, they're killing us right away. Okay. You know, now yeah. we, we like, wow. because, because why? Because wow. they're after our kids. Because when the children for 30 years, a child was brainwashed to kill Russians, 
when it's 30, what the child is going to yeah. think, what the yeah. adult is wow. going to think, right? Wow. And that's what's happening in Canada. So, do you see the bigger proxy? You know, the, the U.S. Of Zelensky course. is of a course. puppet, right? Yes, yes. The same, so they're yeah. trying to weaken Russia, right? Yes, yes, because they are very, very dream would be to have a war in Moscow. And if we did not act two days earlier, they would attack yeah. us. Yeah. We came there to save our children. They're actually preventing future wars, exactly. aren't they? Exactly. I think a lot of the people at NT uh, understand that. And, and right now, the EU, the West, they're just throwing arms in there. Yes. They keep fueling the fire, yes. right? Yes, and they destroy even us here. And I know, it, I, I listened to the Russians, Ukraine, it's breaking their hearts that they're killing each other, right? Some of them. And they, and they just breaking their heart, they hate each other, yeah. yeah. Like they're starting to hate. Yeah, this is what the war is. It's mental it's war, hatred. exactly. Yeah. So yeah. now the relatives hate each other. And this is the war against the Slavic, because wow. the Slavic wow. is very old, ancient people. We have in our DNA freedom. So this is important to, to have this war against us Slavic. So they're dividing the Slavic? Dividing and killing. killing yeah. yeah, turning them yeah. against Destroying, each other. Destroying, yeah. yeah. Exactly. And while they just supply their arms, it's Course. You know who's dying? Russians are dying, Ukrainians yeah. are dying. Right? And, and what happened even before this 20 years? The war was all around Russia on the south as well. They are attacking Russia, you know, through other countries. Yeah. If we do not defend and come there, they come to us. Yes. Yeah. yeah. And how many? 30 years we've been told, telling them there is an agreement with them that do not have your army close. And they are, uh -huh, yes, sure, yeah, sure, and they keep building the army. Yeah, 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 it's wrong. And you know about the Great Reset, the unipolar world, yeah. and NATO's just a, a, an arm of that, right? Yes. A military arm. Yes. This is the bias rules based order, right? Which is the basis of the Great Reset, right? Yeah. Global governance. Yeah. It's great that Russia is standing up to it, isn't it? It is great, but at the same time, they are using Russia as well to do their dirty plan. But we, Russia don't have a choice. We have to protect us, but at the same time, you know, it works to destroy the other world. Destroy the Europe, destroy um, yes. Canada, destroy yeah. America. Yes. So, but I mean, this is maybe the better plan out of just not do anything. Yeah, I agree. And otherwise, they'll just keep coming. Exactly. Eventually, they'll be bombing Moscow. Exactly. Right? Because they've been coming yeah. and coming and coming, and we've been just ignoring for too long. Yeah. And this is the last already drawn. It's amazing the media lies too, right? In the West. Where media doesn't lie. Where is the media doesn't lie? Yeah. When, where, where, yeah, when exactly. did the stock, uh, when, did, when did it yeah. start lying? When did it ever say truth? It's always been lying. It's yeah. a weapon. It's, it's a, a weapon. Their weapon. Yeah, yeah, you're totally right. So, no, I want to thank you for yeah. sharing. And, uh, you know, the, the one good thing is I think the, the Russian Central Bank has been great in dealing with the economic war. And the other good thing is if uh, when Russia wins, we can move to Russia for a better life. <laughs> Isn't that sad? Because eh? you left. And now you got to go back. But right? I am okay with it. I'm proud yeah. Russia now. I'm so happy yeah. Russia is standing up to anti yeah. Christ. Well, a lot of Westerners... And my son will have a choice to make. Yeah. A lot of Westerners are who, who are awake support Russia. Uh, amen. Just amen. So with you know, God. Just with so God. you know. And we've been, you know, we're not stupid. We're, we're looking at the big picture. We're, we're evaluating all the facts. Right? And we see what's going on. And I think the Russian people, like, they're Russian totally behind Putin. So, they they're love totally Putin behind so Putin much. now. He's got the most, yeah. uh, right now, support. 80, over, over 80%. That they invest yeah. so much money to start provocation. They're against Putin. Yeah. Nothing works. In Belarus, nothing no, works. Yeah. Because people see the truth. We follow God, we know truth. Yeah, awesome stuff. Very nice Thanks. meeting you. Thank you. And uh, you have our support. Thank you and, so much. And, you know, we see the bigger picture on this. We think it's great that's going on. We, we don't think global governance dictated by one country is good for the world, right? We don't want, we know the system they're bringing, right? You know the Great Reset, the Fourth Industrial yeah. Revolution, yeah. Reset. they want to control everyone. But we are the people, there is more of us. Yes. And we need to take power back. Yes, we do. And it's global. It has to be people around the world. Yes, unite but together. 
Russia's leading the way right now. Yeah. They are. And they've they been are. so many times. Yeah. They've been many times. Well, look at World War II, what they did. Exactly. They defeated uh, Nazis. Yes. Right? They did not kill them all. So they moved to America, yes. Canada, England, and they it became our government. Killed crazy. all the Jews, uh, yeah. uh, judges yeah. in America, whoever did not agree with them, they cleared. Yeah. So this is what we deal with now. Yeah. Because we've been ignoring and, and thinking they are care about us, something's gonna change. Yeah. But with God, we win. Well, it's great what's going on. There's still a lot of danger lurking. They may try to preempt something. Yeah. They were talking about. Uh, a false flag involving biological chemical or nuclear weapon. Yeah. So it's pretty scary stuff. Because I think the deep state in the West is getting desperate. They see the economic sanctions aren't working. Their if information war is backfiring and they're losing militarily. Meanwhile, look, the inflation in the West. In the UK, Europe, Canada, the US, inflation. People are suffering. And the military is on drop. Those, oh, those in, those in soldiers, Ukraine. Yeah, yeah, in Ukraine, they're yeah. boom, yeah. done. They're going to be dead. Yeah. It's called the boomerang effect. You mm -hmm. can't put sanctions on a trade superpower without yeah. committing economic suicide. So when we put sanctions on Russia, it comes back and it hurts us and we yeah. have to pay. But they put sanctions on themselves. They like to hurt you. Yeah. They are yeah. doing it yeah. to hurt us on purpose. Yeah, yeah. maybe this is the no, financial exactly. reset. Maybe it's triggering a financial reset, right? So they can bring their digital yeah. economy, yeah. right? Garbage, yeah. right? So we're going to keep discussing these yeah. issues. But uh, I want to thank you for thank sharing. Thank you so much. Yeah. Yeah. Great job. Yeah. Freedom. Freedom. Yeah.